All right, let's jump into Faron Woods. And it, the game wants me to use the magic rod, which I did just unlock. Give it a try. Go ahead. Go ahead. Give it a try. From the dangers of the Elven Caves by a mysterious youth named Sheik. Joined by their new ally, Impa's troops exited the caves and emerged in Farron Woods. There, they found a hidden village overrun with monsters. I like to think Impa's like, oh, hello, Sheik, person I don't know, sweating. Hello, Sheik of the Sheikah. They sprang into Clearly one of us named you. <laughs> Nailed it. Battlefield info. A lot of enemies. I'm not surprised. Kill stuff. Oh, oh and they've got redeads. Oh. Oh my god. They're very tall. OC time. She's oh she's a character from this game. Yep. Yeah. She's adorable. Her name is Lana. I have a feeling people don't like her. I feel like generally they're just like, yeah, she's all right. <laughs> uh, I'm not familiar enough with her to know what general consensus is. Considering this is the Lost Woods or the Kokiri Forest, one of the two. I mean, like, it would be cooler if it was Saria or someone. Link's like, ugh. Here we go. Breath of the Wild Link using a weapon he never used. Awesome. <laughs> Well, he had smaller versions of them. Oh, that's a combo. It just becomes a completely different <laughs> weapon at the end. <laughs> they had a lot of fun making the combat in this game. All right, well, the thing with the Deku Babas is we can't hit them. This little perimeter around them, we can't get past. We need to find the bow and arrow so we can kill them from distance. Ooh. Oh. Oh, that looks annoying to walk past, though. There are other paths. Basically, you just have to find the other path to get to the bow and arrow. I mean, I gotta say, putting the effort into making the Deku Bob is an actual threat. Because usually they're just tiny enough to put in a plant. In a potted plant. In a pot. I know where it's. <laughs> it's so goofy, but I love it. Mailman Link? I mean, I'd be mad at you if you weren't wrong, if you weren't right. Like, as in Postman Link? Yeah, as in the job Falco took in Star Fox Adventures. I love the shorts. <laughs> the shorts are good. The hat's good. I got a backpack. I feel like I'm having my own Falco adventure, you know? Yeah. Falco adventures. Fucking mailman adventures. No, this is... I think this was my real passion this entire time. Fox, you've been holding me back. I blame you. I never... I, I never... <laughs> I never said you couldn't be a goddamn mailman. Yeah, but you were... You were insinuating it by your insistence that I'm important to this team. And I was, but I don't want to be. You ever think of that? You ever think Falco wants to suck ass once in a while? I don't understand what you want. <laughs> I want to be a mailman, and I'm not coming back. Uh, all right, go go off, I guess. Go, go off, I guess. If, that, <laughs> if those are your hopes and dreams, Falco, then I think you should chase. Listen, there's a galaxy out there telling me that's this is that this mailman thing is sexual. I assure you it ain't. It's just a passion. Now if you'll excuse me, I gotta go donate my exes to charity. <laughs> hey, let's go, cat. 
You and your stupid cone hat. What's a special for the fire rod? A lot of fire. Oh, a you dragon. Say. <laughs> that's pretty oh, sweet. Yes. <laughs> Didn't hit much with it, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Well, most of the people were dead here, but still, it was nice to see. You know, when we get to command, I'm going to ask you to put fucking cat's portrait on screen again, even though it'll probably already be there. That'll be extra weak. Plus, they could just watch the Star Fox 64 Let's Play where it shows up. What episode does it show up? I'll never tell. Thorn, run into the blue glowy circles and heal your teammates. I will, now that I can get around. Did you a picture of the costume. I see it. Those are shorts. Who wears short shorts? Link wears short shorts, apparently. He looks like he couldn't find anything else to wear. Oh. I mean, this is just like, uh, all I have is this fucking A shirt. Like these, sh my sister's short shorts. This stupid fucking hat from Halloween. Ugh. But why do they all match? <laughs> That's and the part that weirds me out. And why do I love it so much? It must have been, must be fate. Uh, Kethledom asks, question for you guys. For Star Fox games, are you playing Star Fox Assault or just Adventure? Just asking, because I'm a little out of the loop. We will be doing practically every single Star Fox game. It's Adventures, then Assault, uh, then Command, and that also includes Star Fox Zero and Starlink Battlefront, plus uh, the Switch version. Which has Star Fox. Yeah, yeah. so I'm literally just going to call it Star Fox Battlefront. <laughs> right. And maybe Star Fox 2, you said? Maybe. I have to play it first before I decide. It depends on how, like, interesting it is, I guess, because Star Fox 1, it's like, just versus Star Fox 64. That didn't stop me from buying it on as a physical cartridge, but, you know. Plus, I think I brought this up once. The, 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 the Corneria theme in the original Star Fox, they don't really use that theme very much, but, and it, but it's amazing. What about Star Fox 64 3D? Don't need to play it. Star Fox 64 is already done. Yeah. Just Although finished if you it. Can, yeah, if you can get a hold of a copy of it, though, highly recommended. Oh, Star yeah, Fox 3D. Yeah, there's no point to that. Just, to, just show it off for a minute. I mean, like, I keep seeing it. Uh, I keep seeing the Nintendo Selects version at uh, GameStop. And I'm always tempted to buy it, but I kind of just want the original version box. Uh, there is no additional content in the, the 64 3D version. Aside from neater graphics and slightly redone voice work, uh, it's basically the same thing. Oh god, that is like a missile in the Gibdo's face. <laughs> well, I think he oh deserves, my god. He deserves it after all that malarkey he was doing with the stun lock on the poison. Gibdo not. I should play Assault one of these days. I almost did today, but then I just said, nah. Oh, Gib don't. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, chat. Jacob's stupid. We get it. <laughs> just kidding, chat. <laughs> there, Lana. I had to do it for you. I love you too, Galaxy Force. You interact with me on Twitter, and that's more I could than I can ever ask. You too, Breno Gazar. Okay, I just love all of you before everybody asks. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody shows up late to the stream, but do you love me, Jake? 
You know what? Maybe if you showed up on time. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I don't. I. You know what? I don't love people who are late all the time. Oh, you were at work? Pfft. What a loser. So are we. <laughs> well, I am. You guys are. This, yeah, you guys are kind of, but I'm, I'm, I, I got another job. I wish I wish this was my job. But I kind of squandered that by not doing wacky facts all the time. Well, Jacob, if you didn't want to do wacky facts, that's totally okay. I, I know it is. That's why I'm not doing wacky facts. <laughs> <laughs> I also can't imagine, like, well, I mean, I imagine you could have kept it going, but I can't imagine, like, with the algorithm and everything. I don't think you'd be affected by it, but it's like, what do you do now? Wacky facts remix? <laughs> we, yeah. <same>. Kooky <laughs> tax? <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll be a tax channel. I'll, I'll, I'll be like, I'll, I'll be a YouTube channel who's like, figures out what every, what these fictional characters tax refunds will be. Yeah, that was that that's kind of inspired does it does anybody here know the youtube channel legal eagle uh, that's immediately what i was thinking of <laughs> yeah. yes i can almost oh, I see that getting him. an audience what, figuring out what fictional characters tax <laughs> refunds will be i don't think that has the same audience as how long is batman going to jail <laughs> well if he if he didn't pay his tax <laughs> uh eternity Video one complete. Okay, for those for the unaware, Legal Eagle is this YouTube channel run by a real life lawyer, like examines like mostly legal realism and fiction, like TV shows and movies. And sometimes he's like, oh, during the course of this movie, this like Batman committed this many crimes, and he's literally going to jail for like several million years because he wiretapped everyone in New York. That's and a really is... nice looking ocarina, Sarge. Oh yeah, that's fucking, that's sexy. Yeah, it's a very fascinating YouTube channel. Highly recommend it. Dude's very charismatic. Also, welcome back, John. <laughs> well, I do want to kind of start, like, if I could find the time, I want to start making videos again. I have two video ideas. Fucking one that's just about fucking outrageous game like female character designs just kind of laughing at them and being like yeah and this is stupid um and one for i like i want to rank the first level of every main series sonic game because everyone says they're like the best levels in in sonic games and i tend to agree with them but it's time to see which ones are the fucking best but that would mean i have to play the first level of every goddamn sonic game i would have to buy the ones i can't emulate Let's see, after Wacky Facts, would it really be called Kooky Tax? Wouldn't it just be called Wacky Tax? Wacky Tax. Welcome to Wacky Tax. It's time to think like a fucking uh, lawyer. Wait, shit. <laughs> <laughs> that legal legal shows up and he's like, hey, that's my thing. I'm going to sue you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You'd win, too. I don't know what the fuck to do. The Sonic opening stage is City Escape. It'd be up there. I feel like, the, like off the top of my head, the worst one's probably Westopolis from Shadow the Hedgehog. That's it would fair. be up there, yeah. Or down Very there, fair. <laughs> Yeah. What would be worse, honestly? I'm not counting the Sonic Boom games, so... Like the the, sh the shitty running portion that starts Sonic Boom, Rise of Lyric went down. There, There are levels in Sonic Boom? I mean, I, I thought it was that, just one long vomit fest that just kind of strings together. That's that's another reason of that. It's another good reason I'm not going to. I mean, Wave Ocean isn't that bad. No, it's one of the better levels of that game. <laughs> yeah, see, the first level of a Sonic game is always the best. And let's be real, Westopolis is the best Shadow the Hedgehog level. Man, that's a low bar for Shadow. God, Shadow the Hedgehog is... I need to replay it just to make sure I hate it as much as I do. I used to love that game. <laughs> I need to replay it just to know... Just to remember how much I hate it. I own it. I got it on GameCube. Every stream, it always goes to Smash DLC and Sonic. It's unavoidable. 
But the next page, but hey, the next Patreon supported help uh, stream is going to be Sonic uh, Heroes, ain't it? Yep. Once yeah. we've beaten Hyrule Warriors. Looking forward to that. Because I don't think we're going to stay here for the entire game. No. Again, Sonic Heroes. Now that's got a good ass opening level. Might be one of the best opening levels in any 3D Sonic game. I love Sonic Heroes. It's, it's a it's, very. I, I think it's good. It's better than I remember it being, and I remember it being pretty good. If only the light speed dash worked. I know people always ask for Sonic Adventure. Yeah, okay, that I'll actually I'll absolutely give you. The light speed dash is absolutely worse. But that being said, it, it basically is Sonic Adventure 3. Yeah. I know people want a Sonic Adventure 3, but it's basically Sonic Adventure 3. Hey, chicken. Oh, God, hit it. Why hit it when I can throw it into combat and let the enemy hit it? Great for it. Looks like she's just wearing pajamas, actually. It's like you woke me up. Well, it's an upgrade from the nothing they used to wear back in Ocarina of Time. Yeah, like where they vines. just rolled around in a rolled around <laughs> in a pile of leaves and whatever stuck. It's like, yeah, this is my outfit for Good the enough. Day. Good enough. Very. Ah, rain. Rain, rain, stay right here. Otherwise, the forest will burn. <laughs> that guy was wheezing. <laughs> <laughs> the fires are dying out. <laughs> All the ash, and the smoke. I hope somebody isn't going to use a giant fire attack right now and make my cough worse. <laughs> Only rain, you. rain, stay right here. That way we can get some deer. Only you, Link, can prevent forest fires. <laughs> no, idiot, that's the opposite, Link. Link, no. You're stuck with the same weapon for the entire stage, right? Pretty much. Yeah. At least they give them some versatility with the combos. Yeah. I just kind of wish it was like like in Bayonetta where you just press a button and you can change weapons like on the fly. Bayonetta 1 is bullshit. <laughs> I'm remembering this because I'm playing it again. But God. Very, dif very difficult from what I remember. Very difficult. And like, just sometimes which time doesn't work in certain spots. It's not like, oh, I that I should have dodged that and I didn't. It's just like certain specific fights throughout the game. You dodge at the perfect time. Time slows down for like a second, indicating that you did it right. But which time doesn't activate? It, it, why? I'm, I'm begging for an explanation for that. I'm waiting for like, oh, these enemies are affected by which time. I'm sometimes they are in other fights. I'm gonna have to hop on the fucking or Bayonetta and ask like, am I an idiot? Or does Witch Time just not work in specific fights? Bayonetta 2, I've never had that happen. Bayonetta 2 is a better a better game in every way. It's such a fucking excellent damn game. I need to dodge one second later, but I do. <laughs> I would like for you to actually go to the R Bayonetta Reddit and then just write, am I an idiot, but with no extra context? <laughs> <laughs> just, that's the thread topic. Like when it's Yoshi and I were recording Goma. Pikmin 3 and we just message you yellow Pikmin <laughs> and a hundred men or whatever. <laughs> yeah, like... I, I can't wait for the explanation for that. Don't tell me. All right. It's a Goma. Man, I think I brought this up before. It might have been during the Link's Crossbow training stream. But I'm and, and there's this one quip, like one of the loading screen messages in Smash Brothers Ultimate. That's like, despite the fact that you play as Link in most pretty much every Zelda game, his name is only available in five fucking Zelda games. Uh, which ones are they? 
one of them is harder to remember than the others. I was like, did they? Are they talking about talking about the CDI game? Then one fucker in the in the Thorn Discord has to remind me of Link's crossbow training. <laughs> I was like, shit. I was I was gonna be so fucking happy if they actually just like mentioned Link Link faces of evil. <laughs> and you were gonna be like, perhaps I'll get that CDI after all. I do. I want one. Like just for I want that and the Zelda games, but that's a total combined of I could buy a house with that amount of money. I know it was just loading in, but it looked like those knights just went and just appeared when <laughs> Goma just went to the next area. Prison blows in this game. Isn't in prison that big, like black blobby gets guy? Yeah, that constantly comes back at Skyward Sword and gets like new arms and legs the tap oh. dancing shoes every time you beat a boss. Is it Skyward Sword? Yeah. It's I thought it was... Oh, I thought it was from Twilight Princess. No. It looks like a Twilight Princess enemy. The hell he does. I, what do you mean? It's it's like big and gritty. And cartoony. And stupid. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, game set match. <laughs> I mean, I've only seen like the Smash Brothers BU trophy of it. Yeah, if you compare the Twilight Princess art style with uh, the Skyward Sword one, you can see the big difference. So yeah, it originated in Skyward Sword. Oh no, those two knights just poofed to death. They had families and names and whatever. All right, I fucking get you now. Yeah, it looks dumb. Uh, I like its giant, like, teeth-like toenails that are also, <laughs> like, bulgy and squishy for some reason. Squishy. Get him! I need to make the other Look. two do something. The little bar over its head and the bar over there on the left look like two completely different amounts. Wait a damn minute. No, you, Link, you actually stay where you are and you do the job that I was about to tell Sheik to do. <laughs> Which, well, by Link. the way, sucks. Well, Link is currently playing with some jacks and uh, Sheik's got a jump rope going on. Link, Ooh, in the sh eye. Ouchie. Sheik, you go defeat this evil king. Link, take out the garbage. <laughs> Salutes. Dives immediately into a dumpster. Sheik, I need you to save the kingdom from, a, from an evil dragon. Link. Give me some coffee. <laughs> I really thought you were going to say, Link, you stink. <laughs> Link, keep stinking. <laughs> it shrugs. The big... Oh, those here. No, those are. Hold on. Gibdo. Keep saboteur. Gibdos. Okay. I I thought they were those scary guys that looked at you. What are they called? Gibdo. The redeads. Redeads. Yeah. Yeah, redeads. I thought they were redeads because they weren't. They were, they were yeah, the they're actually redeads. I, I got it wrong. Oh, so I was <laughs> stupid, right? <laughs> it's when you're right, but you can't remember what you're right about. I'm very self-deprecating in this stream. <laughs> <laughs> well, to be fair, a lot of limbs are being severed right now. You know what, Yoshi? You make a great point. 
I know, aren't I great? I got some nuggets waiting for me. I'll be back in two seconds. Alright. All right. I did good. You know, but that was really cool build up, but <laughs> that was the wrong way. Oh. That's alright, the knights took the hit, they're fine. As they poof away and non exist. Yo, yeah, guys, you do have shields. Chick is already here, okay. <laughs> Impa has rescued Hylian Captain and nobody else. This bitch is back. Hey, bitch. I mean, Jacob. Hey, bud. God, is Goma still not dead? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the Goma takes a thousand years. Yeah, I mean... It... Oh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. I think that enemy got the point. Well, anyway, I was about to say that I, I looked like he was at the same health point he was like five minutes ago. No, well, <laughs> no, I mean, it's in a different area. It's just Goma likes to hop away and go somewhere else. Oh, I get it. Okay. I thought you yeah. just kept fighting him and it's like, wow, I'm doing nothing. <laughs> God, those poor knights. Here, you guys just need to do a better job of living. Yeah. Fucking dopes. It would be nicer if I could shoot it in the eye when I wanted. This is one of the fights in place testing where I would have I would have been like, you know, uh, I was looking at my wristwatch for most of it. You think we could like shorten it or something? Yeah, this is a bit Rodinkadankalous. Oh, that was a good dodge. Like crabs. 
<laughs> I, you opened the cold one just now, so I was like, I feel like a Jacob <laughs> like, story's gonna come or something. You know, when oh, I think about stuff, oh. uh, go ahead, Jacob. You know what? I got a question. I got a fucking... Not, not only do I have a cold one and a story, I have a story about a cold one. I went, it wasn't even cold, actually, but it was a one. I, so the other day... Well, anyway, the level's CJ, over. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and then Goma 2 shows up, and then I go, continue the story. <laughs> and I'm just like, oh, game's over. Wow, that was a short game. I like Link's nose in this game. It's a little plumpy, and I like it. Ah, oh, good. We <laughs> saved... We saved the one night. Uh, ground control to Jacob. I'm, I'm right here. Okay. <laughs> Apparently I'm cutting out. I don't know why. Yeah, I do find it bizarre that they added, like, a bunch of lip flaps. I, I know, like, in other Zelda games without voice acting, they do it, but it's not that big a deal where here they have, like, a narrator talking most of the time. Through her magic, she could see across ages, able to read the face of all who lived, but never interfering. That is until a unique soul caught her attention. Oh no, the villain wants a boyfriend. Oh, oh she's a villain? villain? Is that really what it's about? Or? That's what it's about. That's what this whole shit is about. Through her powers, He's cute. Should have seen that the hero was bound to another. Well, I mean, on one hand, I don't blame her, but on yeah. the other hand, <laughs> really? <laughs> That's cute what we were with. Cute as hell. Will protect. Great hair. Works out. You know. And while the sorceress was preoccupied, a fragment of go on Tinder. Quit crying. Locked in its prison. You have a crystal ball. There should be crystal tinder. <laughs> Think left. Think left. <laughs> Come on, left brain. Its way into her heart. <laughs> it pushed the light away and warped her curiosity. Oh, no. <laughs> I want a boyfriend. And Ganondorf's like, I too want a boyfriend. Therefore, I possess you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll both get a boyfriend. Think left. Ink left. No, girly, not good enough for you. Conquer Hyrule once again. Having pushed Look at that one. He's cute. The dark he says he likes. He has two cats. You like cats? <laughs> Just get it. Mm, I don't like having. I don't like people having cats that are cuter than mine. Across the ages. That are cuter than me. <laughs> that too. Bringing ruin to the land of Hyrule. You think all cats are cute? Yeah. Think left then. This one's a fireman. Mm. This one causes the fire the fireman puts out. Woo! <laughs> oh, I like that one for Ganon reasons. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I like that guy too. All right, so, so I this is think right. I hope he responds. Ooh, he's cute. He starts fires. He'd be a great asset in taking over the world. Taking over the Hyrule? The Hy no, more than, more than Hyrule. Even Hyrule world. <laughs> 